Have you ever witnessed how complicated the inner workings of the human body are? I thought not. What do we do with the key once we have it? We're playing chess, not checkers. Truth. And we will find the key hidden in one of his organs. And what do we do with Jen herself, who's clearly loath to raise any god? Then be my guest. Learn a demigod without any skin in the game. Well, the far better plan. We need what it opens. But the god of time, this one. Probably gonna crap all over that plan. Somebody. What I said, in no uncertain time. You're trying to trick a guess. To do that. In that case, let's forget everything I said. The human body does only need one kidney to survive. <coughs> no, the Darling, you must mistake me for someone who trusts you. You had a deal with Elizabeth, which I was opposed to. At a time, my dear demigod. Speaking of which, <coughs> I suppose I should kill you now. <coughs> Make certain you don't follow me. I quite like Elizabeth. When that decision involves using the boon of a god, f then I suppose you'll just have to trust me. Mount Olympus. Sorry, wrong number. Listen to me, Aurora. They cut the key from his body and left him chained to that tree instead of trusting him. Ben lied to us. But if Ben doesn't want to raise the gods, why would he deceive us? Ben used to be the homie and all, but... So, are we to trust another god now, Elizabeth? You're in Jen's workshop about to do something stupid. Remember? No sudden moves. <sighs> Fine. <laughs> I'm sorry. You look ridiculous. The gods, whose name escapes me at the moment. Oh dear. My name is Aurora. A flair for the dramatic. A desire. A number of reasons, including the fact that you are not the first charismatic, power-hungry madman that I've encountered in my life. So you don't intend to manipulate or torture information out of me then? Actually. On the menu you have planned, or anything we discuss would satisfy me. Aren't you full of surprises? That was quite refreshing. Gorgeous. It was less so when we arrived, so... You can make such things happen. You are extremely powerful. Now, let's work on that wardrobe, shall we? Not in the modern world, darling. So what would please me is to know why you wish to kill the tribrid. And you thought you could crush her without my help, did you? That sounds like her, all right. <sighs> Not sure yet. I'm unaccustomed to asking for help. The lone lack of love, which world where my betrayal continues. Even someone's- <laughs> Ed of ourselves, shall we? But I don't have to imagine such things. For I have experienced them all myself. He's... The Michelson family abused me, warped my thinking. Am I trapped in an endless cycle or simply being told to walk in a circle? Either way, like you, I've lost everything. I now doubt that revenge can restore it. Confess it, Aurora. Smiting your enemies will bring your mind, even if... But you can, can't you? Return my brother to me, and I will help you kill the tribrid. Then I don't know the point of this incessant journey I've been on, but I do know that I will not help you. Because the many partnerships in my life have only given me hope, and then dashed it before my eyes. So if I meant to learn some lesson, perhaps it's this. I'm doomed to be alone. That's odd. It's hardly a cloud in the sky. It's a choice. Then, took longer than I thought. You misunderstand me, which is my f When I s- You're a bloody hypocrite. 
of your cruelty and your malice. Well, not at first, of course. But then I experienced Ben's memories, his pain, and his suffering for myself. A vampire can see into a person's mind. That kind of judgment, it's, it's frowned upon these days. The modern world is a more forgiving place. I'm not really sure of my place in it all anymore. Please put me down. Your children lied to me. And to you. Nor will I. Me away. His betrayals, his manipulations for what they were. As I've seen your story through your eyes. Is my mind sick? Or is it just another lie I've been told? Well, go on, render your judgment. Then who judges the gods? I will help you kill the tribrid. If you insist. There's something I must attend to. And what is that? The business of gods. You can't be serious. An intruder entered my dream. Is that sleeping in a metal coffin for a millennium? That's how I took the throne from my sibling. In the meantime, you can prove your use. So far, she has been resistant. Or else. Jen? Where are you? Get me to build my dad his weapon. No. I'm not planning on hurting you because I know you're smart enough. No. I've seen enough of it in my lifetime. I want no part in it anymore. People. You misunderstand him. Oh, it's like that, huh? <laughs> Don't tell me. You know what? He showed me his memories. Oh. Awful you, yes, you, and the rest of his family were. Unlike that contrived little sob story you told us to make yourself seem the victim.